The soil sample from an asteroid that landed on Earth on Sunday comes as a giant leap in the quest to study the solar system and scientists at NASA are elated. NASA capsule OSIRIS-REx landing at Utah in the United States brought to an end a seven-year NASA space voyage. Samples from Bennu, an asteroid rich in carbon and classified as a near-Earth object, holds out huge potential for the road ahead. Scientists say it will provide a better understanding of the formation of our solar system and genesis of life on Earth. We just appreciate everyone coming along with us to celebrate NASA's first ever asteroid sample return. It has been incredible. So I'm going to be looking for the basics. Are there clay minerals there? Are there carbonate minerals? Are there organic molecules? Do we see the iron oxides? The other things that we predicted on the asteroid surface. I'm sure there's going to be surprises in there. Once you get into the dust scale, you will probably start to see a wide level of diversity. But it's kind of like a sneak peek of what might be in store for us. Teams are working to transport the sample from Utah to Houston. When it arrives at the Johnson Space Center, the newest phase of the mission begins. The sample will be put in a specially made box for scientists to carefully handle. Scientists will catalog what they have from the sample and study parts of it for the next two years. They will also distribute samples to other scientists around the world over time. 70% of the sample will remain stored for future generations to study. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.